Welcome back to Let's Descend the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. I'm Burning Dog Face. And it happened again! I realized only after I said it. It's only after I said it that I uh, made a reference to the Mark of Cain. I'm gonna be honest, I never understood that. Go for boomerang spears. See if I can find any more coins on this level. No, I cannot. Huh. Wait, if that's a store, what the fuck is that? really useful. <laughs> I'm gonna do something funny. Well, something I think is funny. Whoa! Have to pick one? No? This isn't creepy at all. Is there any way of telling? I don't see any graffiti on the walls pointing over there. Should've done it here. Ah oh, well, I did find that thing. Kane versus Dingle. Mm. Fuck. So Kane, uh, first murderer. Kind of his thing. Uh. Killed by the fucking dingle. The boss that makes farting noises with his mouth. Ah. Huh, synchronized. Yeah, Cain murdered his brother Abel. God called him out on it. And uh, banished him to some super shitty place where there apparently were also people. Despite Cain and Abel being the children of Adam and Eve. Uh... We always gloss over that part. There's people there. Whatever. Um... So Cain worries that the people there will find out he's a murderer and, you know, kill him. And here's the part I really don't get. Uh... He didn't ask for forgiveness or anything, but think, but, uh, God puts a symbol on his forehead, the mark of Cain. that tells everyone who sees it not to mess with this guy, because he's under God's protection. Uh, 
That's a great win streak. Fuck it, I'm gonna go with the one I uh, know that I like. I think the game adapts to uh, your skills. It gets harder as you get better. And now I started the game and the golden item room is right here. Bobby Bomb! Homing Bomb. I would say I feel insulted, but, well, I can't win for losing, so... Oh, okay. Ah. Sorry, my arm was really itchy. Mmm! <laughs> delicious! Spiders are one of the things they added in this. Either this or the Wrath of the Lamb. Ah. I was checking my stats. Wait, what are the... I just realized that the only two of these I'm pretty sure I understand are the first one and the last one. The first one is obviously speed, and the last one is luck. And the one they present to you off the bat is uh, strength, I think it's a sword, so I guess that's not how much damage I do, but... What's the difference between the arrows in flight and the arrow in the bow? And what's that other thing? Might as well go take a look. Even if Maggie's uh, default running speed is a placid stroll. Well, there's that. I just have to assume that all of the locked doors are stores. I wonder if it's always been like that. Somehow I... Fuck. Never picked up on that before. Oh yeah! Fuck! I really aren't into doing any damage to him until he shows his fucking face. Oh dear. I don't like the haunt very much. In fact, the haunt can go to hell. These things move faster than I do, and that sucks. Slowed down a little. Is he not gonna cover his face up again? Cause I'm okay with that. No! Suck it!
He has a lot of bathroom problems. When that's... Y'all saw that, right? Sister Laws and Drapper say, get back in there, champ. What do you mean, Curse of the Blind? It's not messing any of that. The map is keeping track of stuff. I can see these enemies just fine. they have a mouth above their eyes reminds me of that one enemy from Doom 3 that looks like a spider made out of a human head except the head is upside down That's why there was only one. Okay, so I thought that was like herdy blood. Okay, what's the trick? Other than the fact that it sucks and they're around a corner, I mean. Satisfying. Oh, sick. Curse of the Blind, great. So I can't even see that. So, you know, if you've been playing the game for a zillion years, and you know, uh... You know, you could just look at an item and go, Oh, I know exactly what that is. You know, I shouldn't pick that up because it's shit. Or because it would interfere with this build I've got going on. Time he does that. Not a satisfying amount of damage.
The yeah. item down here is always a health up item, I believe. A snack. It was probably something like dog food, or a severed hand, or... You know, a physical manifestation of the ennui of a lost generation. Something pleasant like that. So is that supposed to be his mother giving him the gift of a turd in a box? So I thought the intro implies that Isaac and Mom were actually pretty happy before uh, she went crazy and started hearing things. I had a bomb, that would be a really nice spot to put it. The enemies that I don't want to have a uh, death trail. That is one of them. Right at the top of the list. Those he those heads that sort of just vibrate angrily and shoot at you every once in a while. Them I wouldn't mind. They barely move. Damn it. You know, I think this is the first time when Maggie's uh, below par speed is uh, really annoying to me. Nice! Fuck it. Oh. Wonder if I still have the curse of the blind. Well, I have thirteen. There could be two more cents here. Remember that one time when I found so many speed upgrades in a Maggie run <laughs> that I couldn't control her? Kept running into da running into damage and I was trying to dodge damage. <laughs> Still, my farthest runs in Classic Isaac were always with Maggie. Kill those butts. Kill them dead. Kill them before they can do get up to any trouble. Take that, you dirty butt. No. No, I don't want a key.
No! Oh, this is a really bad combo. Nay. Who's that from? Oh, yeah. Vampire RPG. The guy talked in Old English because he'd been in a coma since like 1120. I'll just get this. I'll call it a day. <laughs> Shit! I didn't know it was. I thought it would just add boomerang qualities to my tears. Dick! Well, in any event, I'm burning dog face. And this has been another deeply unsettling session of Let's Descend the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. I'll see you next time when Maggie continues kicking ass and taking names. But first, I guess I'll have to return to Let's Play Star Wars The Force Unleashed and face Imperial Rexus Prime. Yay. <laughs> Later, guys!